the day every rebel looks forward to when they arrive on campus, senior day. And this class has proved on and off the field what it means to be a rebel. After dropping the Thursday and Friday games in the series, the Tigers came out attacking in the finale, scoring a pair of runs in the first two frames. Full count coming to Stephen Williams. Down and in, ball four, bases are loaded, and that is four walks for James McArthur in an inning and a third. And Mike Bianco is going to make a change. Hey, we need you right here. We need an effort, all right? Three-hole guy here. First pitch will be a slider away. Give us a good one. Ground ball back. You can go home. Sure. Signal set. Let's go. Strike three called. Painted the outside corner. That's three straight breaking balls, and they're two down in the inning. Threw him the slider and struck him out. He just gave up on it, hit the outer edge, painted the corner with that one. Back-to-back -back strikeouts by Will Etheridge out of the bullpen, and Auburn leaves them loaded. Etheridge kicks and delivers again. Swing and a miss. He struck him out on a fastball. Decided just to run one by him. Yeah! Two big pitches! Had a way to bat, had a way to bat, I had a baby. Really, uh, you just try to minimize what, what's uh, on base. You know, with, with bases loaded and one out, you just really try to think about getting a ground ball to a play. But, uh, you know, it still worked out getting two strikeouts. Unfortunately for us, you know, uh, James didn't have a great day, but Will comes in and, you know, gets, you know, gets a couple big strikeouts, gets us off the field, and, you know, allows us uh, to, to stay in the game. With their hurler escaping disaster in the top half of the inning, freshman Anthony Servidio was able to wreak a little havoc of his own. Hey, hey, hey. You're gonna get fastballs, right? Yes, you know, so you can't you gotta go for them, right? Shorter swing you got, get to the fastball. Come on. This one, not close, line drive to right field. Golson gonna try to come around to score. The throw to the plate, cut off, middle of the infield. Swung on, line drive, base hit to right for Anthony. Right fielder Williams will glove it. He's gonna throw toward the plate. Golson's gonna try to score, he will. The throw it's to very cool to see him succeed like that. To see him do that, come in in that situation is very, very big. I knew I was gonna get a fastball, so I'm just thinking just put a good swing on it, be short to the ball, and just try to drive in those runs. Kessinger into the left center gap. This one gets down and it will go all the way to the wall. Servideo comes around to score. And Greg Kessinger, a stand-up RBI double, ties this game at two. Yeah, get that guy. Yeah. Yes, Greg Kessinger trots into second with an RBI double, and we've got a tie ball game. It's 2-2. Back on top, the Rebs insurance policy cashed in on the mound. Ground ball toward Kessinger, gets the hop, throws the second to video. Now to first base for the double play, and that'll end the inning. Nicely done. Good job. Where well, you keep filling up. That was a good pitch on that five ball. Didn't hit it. It was a good pitch. You know, because they showed us the side shot of it. It was high enough. Just bad, you know, bad luck. The 0 2 to Jarvis. Strike three. Gracious. Just ate him up with three sliders, and he took another one. Third strikeout for Will Etheridge since entering. There it is. 
Got the outside corner, back-to-back -back looking strikeouts. Keep filling it up, man. Look great. Keep filling it up. Whenever a starter doesn't have his best stuff that day and having Etheridge be able to come in and pick him up like that, it's a huge weapon for us. Anthony, there he goes. Here's the pitch. It's inside the throw to second, catching a tag, and he is out of there. Locked in a tied ball game in the seventh, the Rebels called on the pack to polish the sweep. The Wolfpack is just something where everybody's got to do their own job. You know, get on, somebody's got to knock him in. We just got to uh, execute what we're doing. He's going to hit a home run right here. 3 1 pitch, swung on, fly ball, right field. It's got legs. It is gone. Showers in right for Tyler Keenan, and the Rebels regain the lead at 4 to 3. Didn't I call that? Ooh. I just called that. Keenan hits a fly ball to right. Williams goes back, he'll watch it fly, and Ole Miss takes a 4-3 lead. Bro, I literally called that on that pitch. Mm -hmm. On the camera. On the camera. Yeah. Sure. No, I did. Lefty ready and delivers. Swung on, ground ball to the third baseman over his head. It's a fair ball! It's a fair ball and one run scores, two runs score. The left fielder just now digging it out. And the Rebels go up six to three. The one-one to Fitzsimmons. Swung on, fly ball, left field, well stroked. That is going to be over the head of the left fielder Davis for a double. Two runs will score and Fitzsimmons has done it again. Amazing. Thank you, man. I love that. Yes, sir. I Thank love you. That. Congratulations. Reps are rolling right now. Uh, just got a sweep in front of the best fans in college baseball. Uh, Etheridge was dominant today, and uh, you know Fago was dominant yesterday. So good pitching, good hitting all around, and uh, hopefully keep this momentum going into Alabama.